Clicks and creaks can, on a bicycle could be difficult to pinpoint. We have some references on what to look for in the upper right hand corner over here. In this particular case, I noticed most of the clicking and creaking coming when I was going uphill, pulling hard on the handlebars. On the flats, when I relaxed my hands, it was less. If I completely relaxed when I took them off the handlebars, it disappeared. This suggested that there was something in the bar bracket or handlebars that was giving me some noise. Trying to push or on either side of the handlebars when here in the shop didn't produce any noise. And also there was no flexion. If you have a carbon fiber handlebars and you do get some flexion, you need to take it to a shop to make sure that it's not damaged. We solved this problem. Let's take a look and see how we did this. Most of today's bicycles have small markings, which you can barely see here, that allow you to reposition the handlebars at the correct tilt and also allow you to center the handlebars. Take note of that. That's off. Take a photo. Otherwise, take a photo from the front and the side so you can reposition the handlebars where they were before. With a 4 millimeter Allen key, we'll go ahead and re remove the handlebar bolts. We're going to keep this one loose but still installed, and I'll show you why in a minute. Using this uh, coated wire that used to go around a head of lettuce I bought at ShopRite, we're going to use it to hold on to the handlebars so they drop just a little bit when we remove the last bolt. We'll uh, soak the bolts in some biodegradable degreaser. Let that sit for about 10 minutes. Now we'll remove each one. We're going to wipe them dry. We'll do that with all four. When thoroughly dry to the threads of all the bolts, we're going to use some Loctite Blue, medium strength, which will hold the bolt in place, but still allow us to remove it if we need to. With some degreaser, we'll wipe the clamp. as well as the handlebars. Get all that dirt off. Then we'll wipe this completely dry. Another key in getting rid of that handlebar creaking is using fibro grip, which is uh, used for carbon fiber material, but can be used for other sources. It has small particles that when you tighten the bolts will be compressed and prevent slippage. It'll be important to go ahead and coat the inside contacts. Of the clamp. And then go ahead and reassemble. As you tighten the hex bolts, be sure to set the handlebars to the centering position that you had, either the markings on the handlebars or your photograph, as well as the tilt of the handlebars, and then continue to tighten the bolts. Finally, using a torque wrench, torque 
the clamp bolts to the manufacturer's specification, which in this case is written directly on the clamp itself, and it says 5 newton meters. If we set the torque wrench to 5 newton meters, if uh, it's not written on here, you may have to look up the manufacturer specification on the internet and we'll go ahead until it clicks on all the bolts. Now when I take this out on the road, even pulling hard on the handlebars, no more creaking. Problem solved. If you have any other suggestions, please comment below. Please subscribe to keep up with our latest videos. This is Tony of Tony 10 Speed. Safe cycling.